thought I told Greg a story, but apparently I didn't. So he hasn't seen the video yet. Um, so, and I haven't told him the story yet. Um, but it's been a busy day and I've been at the hospital with my daughter. And there's something that Greg knows about me. What happens whenever stuff goes awry with my daughter? Sometimes I get a little... Anxious. <laughs> Antsy. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so like, you know how we've boycotted Starbucks since like they're bullshit? Yeah. Okay. So look at the video that I just sent you, but look at my Facebook and watch the video and I'm going to record your reaction. <laughs> Hang on, let me get my laugh out first. Okay. Are you going to your Yeah, you gotta unmute it. <laughs> now listen, now listen, it gets better. It gets better, okay? Cause like for one, I had that shit blaring and I was like at the corner so the acoustics, it was bumping that whole place. I was having a good time, but like we was in the villages, they wasn't having a good time. The bitch in front of me, right? But like, you know, I get kind of like anxious, right? So like, you know, I wish a bitch would, cause like I tell you all the time, like I wake up wishing a bitch would, like take a shower. I wish a bitch would. So like I was wishing a bitch would, cause you know, like I had nothing better to do and like I had to wait for my daughter to be out of surgery and like sometimes you need something to distract you and sometimes ain't nothing better to distract you than a bitchy ass Karen at a damn Starbucks trying to get some coffee and mama rapper sitting behind her ass and I'm playing the art of war and bitch I wish you would cause I ain't got nothing better to do and like I was just on the phone with my psychiatrist and like my daughter's in the hospital and they already tripping on me today and like I ain't trying to have it and like I only had three hours of sleep and everybody knows the people that have like head problems that's not good you know what I'm saying so like I wish a bitch would so like this bitch cracking her neck the one that's in front of me so like it got louder up in the car so then we rolled up to the front like right at the drive through and I'm thinking you know these people inside want to hear this shit you know what I'm saying that's a good song it's an art of war like it's a good song it should be heard everywhere you know what I'm saying and like the village just ain't just ain't heard it yet like but none of those people in those Cadillacs enjoyed that but I was like in the key of soul like whoop whoop but anyways like cause you know I get a little Feisty, you know what I'm like not feisty, anxious. <laughs> watch, I gotta watch my word. So like, but like really, I thought we was just having a good time. But like the bitch in front of me looked like she was kind of having a I want to crack my neck today kind of thing. Cause she was like, ah. so I was like, bitch, I wish you would, would. Like, and I'm saying a lot enough for her to hear me. Cause like I said, it's going acoustic. Like Austin's over here. Like. <laughs> That's why I think he called a ride back. <laughs> he, he told, he said, he, he said after I got him back to the hospital, he said, I, my grandma, my grandma was going to come get me. I said, oh, okay. <laughs> But like, I had a three hour wait. And I had nothing better to do. I was bored. <laughs> Bitch, I, I want to play a game. <laughs> I want to see what it do. <laughs> I'm just saying. It's an art of war, bitch. Like, I can't stand a motherfucking Karen. But let's play the art of war. Let's finish the video with the art of war. You did tell me that story, but what you didn't tell me was the Austin part. <laughs> and that makes it so much funnier. 
Because I don't, I don't think you had mentioned that he was in the car in the first story. I think you had just told me about fucking Carrie. Oh, I didn't think I told Art you. War. You didn't tell me about Blasting Art of War. Oh. I did forget that that was at Starbucks. Mm. Uh, but whenever you started telling the story, I went, oh, yeah, I do know the story. Oh, it's epic. But let's play the Art of War. Yeah. Let's give the Art of War a shout out. But, like, I really was just trying to have a good time. And, like, that's a good song to have, like, at Starbucks. You know what I'm saying? By Lord Strainer by Rotla. On Band Lab. Go into my collections. Oh, Odin's collections. My collections. I have that one. Where is that? I have no fucking clue. <laughs> I don't ever build collections. I only started building collections for like very few. Cause like I have playlists on everything else. You know what I'm saying? You could turn that up. I'm shaking. I need to get some sleep. I'm exhausted. Ooh. Right after this song, I'm gonna go to bed after I hit that bong again. But, like, honestly, I've had three meltdowns today. My dog fucking ate my shit. Like, $1,000 in his mouth. Turn that up a little bit more. Can it go louder? I'm gonna be all lyrical tomorrow. Why? Damn, I wish I wouldn't have told you the story earlier. <laughs> I said, I wish I wouldn't have told you the story earlier. But the Austin thing was pretty epic. <laughs> Whenever you said I, I got a rival my grandma, I was like, uh, <laughs> I understand, son. I try to get away from myself, too. <laughs> Bitch, I want to play your game. Do you need to cut down on your nicotine habit? Even mama rapper in critical what? I say he needs to cut down on his nicotine habit. You heard? I'm a blast, the art of war. What? <laughs> when Austin see that bitch try to like break her neck, bitch, come back here, let me break that neck. <laughs> <laughs> you heard I say rawr. I can never rawr good. <laughs> it sounds more like I can meow good though. And look, a feline is a fierce fucking female. I'm like the fucking. What? Don't don't support the phones. Support the real. You know what I mean? I can't even see you talking about how they I thought they wanted to blast out of war there too. Like it's Starbucks, you know what I'm saying? Like they don't care about our community. We could turn it down in a minute. No. And tell me if that's some real if that's real to you. You know what I mean? Listen to what they're saying. Don't just bob your head to the beat. Keep the game. And listen to what I'm saying. And hold us accountable for it. You heard? I thought they wanted to blast the Art of War of Starbucks and the villages and all the Trump pin signs around. Like, I thought that that's what they wanted to listen to. But I guess they don't know nothing about that culture. 
Like, they didn't like the acoustics in their own damn parking lot either, but, like, the, the way that the garbage can was, like, faced this way in the corner of the building and the way that I come around this corner, <laughs> it's fun. That's why I was, like, pointing it to the thing because it was bouncing off the wall. Like, the whole car was bumping. I got a key to soul. That bitch bumped. And the bitch in front of me, and whenever I turned it up louder and louder, Austin was like, damn, like, this bitch real crazy. And I was like, I ain't got nothing better to do today. <laughs> and like this bitch talking about, I can't go back there with my daughter. Bet you that cyborg says I can. What? <laughs> like, <laughs> no, I just recorded a long ass video. <laughs> I need to go to bed. Night, y'all.